uh, my name is Jenny Holloway and I'm the CEO of Fashion Enter and I'm sitting here in the <laughs> Chanel offices with Alicia who used to be one of our apprentices. So <laughs> Alicia, you were always an outstanding student, okay? And I'm not Thank just saying you. that for the camera, <laughs> I'm saying that because that is really genuine. Your portfolio was a thing of beauty. Do you remember how much effort you put into it? Yeah, I did, I did. I was. It was an amazing opportunity for me. Um, I just have grown up in, in Derbyshire and that was kind of my background in education. So moving to London and kind of becoming immersed in fashion enter and um, the job that I had at Hobbs was a really amazing opportunity for me. So the job was an apprenticeship, it was a level three garment technologist. Yeah. Right. Do you want to just explain a little bit about that two year period? Yeah, definitely. So the kind of structure of the apprenticeship was, it was one day at Fashion Enter, which was kind of the theory, the theoretical side where we sort of covered, obviously we went through the apprenticeship. Um, and then the other four days was in the head office at Hobbs where I sort of, we sort of had a role almost created for us. So it really felt like you were working towards a kind of end goal and you were really immersed within the company. And those two very particular things came together in such a beautiful way that you were learning and you were developing and growing through Fashion Enter and Fashion, fashion, fashion Enter's tutoring. And then you were actually applying that theory into the physical and um, day-to-day role at Hobbs, which was, yeah, an amazing opportunity. And I definitely felt I grew so quickly through that. Oh, you did, yeah. I mean, we, we could see that. And and actually, we're not a normal college or training provider. Like, we really care, right? And we, we go above the call of duty. But I do, after all this time, so I remember your portfolio, but because it was so beautifully put together, you always had really, really high standards, and you got the best out of it. And you weren't afraid as well to ask for more. You know, you wanted to go down on the factory floor, and that was the beauty of Fashion Enter. You know, at that time, it was called Frameworks, it's now called Standards. But I just remember you excelling, so I wasn't surprised when it was offered you a job. So, yeah. you, so you you went straight in as a garment technologist, didn't you? I did, yeah. I went in as a junior garment technologist, um, which I did for a third year. And there I was sort of really developing and honing the skills that I'd learned through Fashion Enter. And I think that, again, as Jenny said, that was one of the lovely things about it, is it was so immersive you were in the factory. So to really understand that you could go and see people doing the patterns and, and doing the cutting and watching how actually clothes were manufactured, which as a garment technologist, that is so important to have that understanding. And then now, so how many years ago was that? Was that about five years ago? Yeah, I think it was, yeah, five, six years ago now. So explain where you are now. So now um, I'm a senior executive in travel retail at Chanel. Um, I work for the beauty department and the uh, beauty and fragrance. Um, and just to kind of deep dive into that a little bit more, it's very much kind of to do with our relationships with our retailers. So it's kind of a very encompassing role. Um, my director actually sits between, she deals with both the UK and South Africa as well. So it's, um, it's kind of supporting her very much in, in what she does. And I think what's brilliant about this example of, of your career is flexibility, you know, having a can-do attitude. You, you were always positive, right? even when things go wrong, and they do go wrong you know, in <laughs> career and in business, but you always were such a positive force of nature. And I think that has put you in really good stead. And I think with all apprenticeships, it's just a starting point, isn't it? You know, and it, it's just that first step into the world of business. Completely. And what I would say is so brilliant and special about the apprenticeship in itself is that it's really giving you those core skills and what I would say is I'm probably quite a good example of okay I haven't ended up becoming a garment technologist but everything that I learned and everything I did just the like being kind of diligent the discipline the routine of having um, a job when I started when I was 19 was you know that's all taken me to where I am now and I mm. definitely I think had I gone to uni and gone a different route I don't think I would be here you can't beat experience sometimes. You know, I this, completely agree. You, you, to, to be there and immersed into that world of commerce and understand time pressures and working in a team but having independent thoughts, you know, all those areas, you just grow and develop. And I think if anyone was a great example of what apprenticeships was about <laughs> and how to succeed, we're just all so delighted for you. Oh, you know? so kind and I just wish you. you all the very best and look forward to seeing you in the newspapers. <laughs> <laughs>